Hello, welcome to the channel. This is the Baron. We are here today to bust another case of Flesh and Blood Everfest First Edition. Uh, it was uh, too cheap for me to pass up since I still needed some stuff. I'm like, I had to buy it. Because we're literally, I think, needing like $35 worth of cards out of a box in order to break even. I think that's what we'll end up at. Let's see. I'm going to do my standard one box at a time, numbering our boxes. There we go. Get these guys out of the way. Stack them up in the back. And get into box number one. I have more room this way. Let's see. I think our camera's still a little bit shaky, but I'm trying to get it better. I'm trying to give a little bit more of an overview. See how this works out for us. We definitely have a lot of packs to go through. And if I can get into them, then I will put all of the commons probably in there. Let's get into these. Let's see if I'm too close or not close enough. All right. Uh, I got to remember where these go. Are we going all the way to the back on these? Yeah, it looks like we're going all the way back to the foil and then a rare and then a rare. Okay. It's been a minute. Different products, different rules. Rares, rares. Okay. So... You know, on this stuff, we are looking for the foil. The foil is where good things happen. So there is a common foil, a rare, and a rare. Because we have EA foils in this. Rare foil this time. And a rare, and a rare. I remember where... Majestics all the way in the back or right after the foil? We have a foil and then a rare and a majestic, so it can be in the back. There we go. We have a guardian action. There is our first majestic. And we are into the foil, rare and rare. into a common foil, a rare, and a rare. We have a common foil, a rare, and a rare. Definitely waiting on the Majestics or something bigger. Here we go. We have a rare foil. A rare and a rare. It's a fun looking rare. I don't remember that one. Now we have a cool token foil, a rare and a majestic bow. Dreadbore. I don't know who uses Dreadbore. Oh. Aziri. I don't know if it's her. But we got a majestic weapon. And we have common foil, a rare, and a rare. It seems like we're light on majestics, it seems like. Common foil, rare, and a rare. Ooh, I use a lot of that Guardian Rare. And we have a Rare Foil. A Rare and a Rare. So first half of the box, uh, not exciting. Two Majestics. And we have a Common Foil. 
a rare, and there we go, another Majestic Rune Blade action this time. That's better. We have a Guardian Common Foil, a rare, and a rare. We have a Majestic Foil, Shatter. Warrior Action Reaction, followed by a Cold Foil Rare Amulet. That looks really good, followed by a Rare. So we got our, finally got a Cold Foil. You can get two out of these. You got a Foil Majestic, Foil Common, a Majestic. This round's on me, and a Rare. Now we're picking up with the Majestic. I think this rounds on me is pretty good. Foil Common, Rare, and Shimmering Sliver Majestic. Now we're getting in more of a normal Majestic count, I think. Rare Foil, Rare, and Rare. Just all in one stack. Things are happening. Okay, we got a common foil, a rare, and a rare. We got a common foil, a rare, and a majestic nervous nerves of steel. What is that? A guardian. Okay. All right. We've got some majestics now. Didn't hit any of the big ones, but we got a bunch of them. Common foil. Rare and rare. And we got a rare foil, a rare and a rare. We've got a common foil, a rare and a rare. And here we go. Last pack, Let's see if we get any magic out of here. We get a common foil, a rare, and a rare. So, when you get a very cheap box, and it does not pay off. I think uh, this round's on me is probably the best thing. I don't know if I need this one yet or not. Uh, this might be a good hit just out of the needing it for the collection, but I like it better when there's two in a box. Definitely makes it easier. So that's it for box number one. If you're enjoying these videos, please like, subscribe, and all that fun YouTube stuff. And I will see you next time.